In this video, I'm going to show you how you can get some royalty-free images using stock photos. Let's check it out. So stock photos are basically uh, what they call royalty-free photos. So basically, you don't have to pay someone any royalty fees for using these types of photos. If you were to take, for an example, if you were to go to Google and let's say you you had an Apple website. Maybe you're selling iMacs or, you know, electronics or something. And you took one of these, uh, I don't know, let's say this is a real Apple image and you took this straight from their website. If they ever found out, they could potentially sue you or charge you some royalty fees for using their images without their approval. So in order to get around that, you want to basically go to, like I said, the stock photos and you can purchase these stock photos and that way you can use them however you want, when you want, and you don't have to pay any royalty fees. So let's say you still wanted to try to find some Apple computer products. Let's see if we can find any stock photos. Okay, so here we go. I typed in here the iStock photo. So I could use, for example, this Apple ITV stock photo maybe this iPad stock photo. Um, this looks like a mobile iPhone stock photo. So these are all stock photos. These that, Like I said, you can use these images. You can purchase them with certain credits. And now once you do, you can actually have the right to use this on your website without worrying about any legal issues. So one of the couple websites that I recommend is like iStockPhoto.com. Um, another one is Big Stock Photos. So BigStockPhoto.com is also a really great one. And if any of these don't work for you, you could always just Google Stock Photo. And there's so many that show up. As you can see, there's iStock Photos. One of the, Shutterstock is a great one. Um, you know, I already showed you about Big Stock Photo. So you get the idea. You can really uh, search for all kinds of images and add them to your website. So I hope you guys enjoyed this quick tutorial on stock photo images, and I'll see you guys in the next video.